Hi dear students, in this class, that means uh, we are going to know about one of the very very important inorganic compound that comes under the T block elements. That means the name of this compound is boracin. The name of this compound is boracin. Generally it is called as inorganic benzene. That is boracin. We know we are familiar with the organic benzene. We know we are familiar with the organic benzene. We know we are familiar benzene. That means boracin. It is the one of the derivative of bora. This is the product of bora. This is the product of bora. That means it is isoelectronic and isostructural with benzene. This is the electron and benzene. You can see this is the uh, borosin. Its other name is boroso. This is the pair of In this class, we are going to know, uh, prepare. How we can prepare this borosin in the laboratory? In the borosin in the laboratory, we can prepare this uh, This uh, uh, borosin, this borosin is prepared from uh, prepared from uh, diborane. That means the borosol is prepared from uh, diborane. Diborane. That means if uh, if the diborane is treated with the excess ammonia at low temperature, at low temperature, that means the temperature is at about uh, minus 153 Kelvin, there is a formation of one compound called diborane diammonate. So, this is diborane diammonate 3B2H6 uh, 2NH3. Then, this is the structure of this. Diborane diammonate. Diborane diammonate. But uh, if it is heated, that means that if the diborane is heated with the excess ammonia at a high temperature, at a very high temperature, the diborane on the Adhikamana Vapandilila Nambapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapapap